Piezo is a technique that only cuts bone and not soft tissue, which means if we uh, cut on the bone and there is underlying mucosa, we prevent uh, it damage to the mucosa, which will then reduce hematoma to the face. That's a fantastic advantage. However, the process of cutting bone with the piezo is much longer than we would use with a drill or with a mechanical saw or even with chisels. So there is a learning curve, we have to allow more time, but I think for the patient it might hold some advantages. I had the most problems with the lateral osteotomy where you need to do quite a bit of degloving, but uh, it and it takes longer, but the median or paramedian or median oblique um, osteotomies were fine and fantastic is a drill they have a pointed piezo stick where you can easily drill a hole through the bone in the anterior nasal spine or in the lateral bones if you want to have a suture pulling them together or for, a, for an extracorporeal septoplasty. So that, that drill itself is excellent. Well, I tried it once, but it has a lot of side effects. There are only smaller groups who are promoting them, but the problem first, the device is very expensive. If there is a device, because MaxFax people use it since many, many years, they have a lot of experience. What is new are specific instruments for rhinoplasty, but the device itself is a very well-known device. You need a lot of water to cool it down. You need a white degloving, which has also a lot of other side effects and which is time consuming. Therefore, I don't think if somebody has in his clinic this device, it might be helpful, but to buy it, I don't see so many advantages that I would buy it by, for myself.